Have you ever thought that something as small as the nuts you snack on could be the difference between staying strong and vital after 60 or slipping into silent decline without even realizing it? Most men over 60 have no idea that while certain nuts can supercharge testosterone circulation and performance, others can quietly choke blood flow, dull sensitivity, and drain confidence over time. In this video, I'll reveal five nuts proven to support your testosterone and two common nuts you must avoid at all costs. Stay with me because the last bad nut is one most men eat almost every day and it could be silently stealing your vitality. If you want to protect your testosterone type boost in the comments right now, I recently spoke with a 65-year-old man who was proud of his nightly spoonful of peanut butter. He thought it was healthy until his energy and drive collapsed. It wasn't his fault. Most men are never told the truth about how these foods affect hormones. And here's the reality studies show nearly 40% of men over 60 struggle with low testosterone, bringing fatigue, mood swings, muscle loss, and poor sleep. The good news, simple dietary changes can make a dramatic difference. In the next 14 minutes, I'll show you the five nuts that can help rebuild testosterone, the two that work against you, and the one practical swap at the end that could make you feel 40 again instead of 60. Let's start with the problem. According to CDC statistics, around 40% of men over 60 in the United States have clinically low testosterone. That's almost one in every two men your age. The symptoms are not always obvious at first. You may notice fatigue that doesn't go away a lower sex drive or a change in mood. Over time, low testosterone is linked with muscle loss, stubborn belly fat, poor sleep, and even a higher risk of diabetes. The good news is that testosterone decline is not completely inevitable. And one of the simplest ways to push back against it is through nutrition. So why focus on nuts? Nuts are small, but they're nutrient dense. They contain healthy fats, protein, vitamins, and minerals that are the building blocks for hormone production. Your body needs cholesterol and certain fatty acids to make testosterone and nuts are one of the richest natural sources. But here's the shocking truth most men don't know, not all nuts are equal. Some actually boost testosterone while others can interfere with your hormones and promote inflammation. That's why it's so important to know the difference. Let's go through the five nuts that can make a real impact on your testosterone and vitality. Number one, Brazil nuts, often called the selenium powerhouse. Just one or two Brazil nuts a day can provide your entire daily requirement of selenium, a mineral that plays a direct role in testosterone production and prostate health. In fact, researchers at the University of Arizona showed that selenium supports male fertility and hormone function. But more is not always better. Too much selenium can be toxic, so limit yourself to just one or two Brazil nuts per day. That tiny amount is enough to protect your testosterone and your prostate. Number two, walnuts, the circulation king. Walnuts are rich in omega-3 fatty acids, which improve blood flow, reduce inflammation, and support overall cardiovascular health. At UCLA, researchers found that men who ate walnuts regularly had better sperm quality and hormone balance. For older men, the benefit goes beyond fertility. Good circulation means better delivery of hormones throughout the body and even better performance in the bedroom. Aim for about 7 to 10 walnut halves daily, ideally at breakfast when your body is primed to use those nutrients. Number 3. Almonds the Vitamin E Champion Almonds provide a strong dose of vitamin E which acts like a shield against oxidative stress. Oxidative stress is one of the hidden enemies of testosterone slowly degrading hormone quality and production. Almonds also provide magnesium, a mineral that helps with muscle strength and deeper sleep, both of which are critical for men over 60. One of the best ways to prepare almonds is to soak them overnight. This softens them, makes them easier to digest, and increases the absorption of their minerals. A handful of soaked almonds in the morning can go a long way towards supporting your hormones. Before we move to the fourth nut, let me say this, the next one isn't just good for testosterone. It's also been shown to improve sexual performance in clinical studies. Number four, pistachios the arginine booster. Pistachios contain the highest amount of an amino acid called arginine, which your body uses to produce nitric oxide. 
nitric oxide is essential for relaxing blood vessels and improving circulation. A study from Turkey demonstrated that men who consumed pistachios daily experienced significant improvements in erectile function and overall satisfaction. The key is to choose unsalted pistachios ideally in the shell. Eating them in the shell slows you down, helps control portions, and makes the experience more mindful. Pistachios are not just a snack, they are a natural aid for circulation and hormone health. Number 5. Macadamia Nuts the Clean Fat Source Unlike many other nuts, macadamias are composed of over 80% monounsaturated fats. These fats are clean-burning for your body, anti-inflammatory, and very low in omega-6, which is known to interfere with hormone balance when consumed in excess. Macadamias are calorie-dense, so stick to about 10 to 12 nuts per day. They provide your body with the perfect type of fat for stable testosterone production without the downside of excessive inflammation. Now that you've heard about these five nuts, let me ask you, which of them do you already eat regularly? Comment the name below, because your answer might help another man discover a better choice for his own health. To recap this first half of the video, Brazil nuts provide selenium and protect your prostate. Walnuts improve circulation and hormone balance. Almonds shield testosterone with vitamin E and magnesium. Pistachios increase arginine and support sexual function. Macadamias provide clean fats that prevent inflammation. These five nuts are simple, delicious, and widely available in every American grocery store. And by making them part of your daily routine, you're giving your body the raw materials it needs to maintain testosterone after 60. But we're not done yet. Because while these five nuts can build you up, two common nuts in the American diet may be tearing you down. One of them is sitting in almost every American kitchen and men eat it every day without knowing it could be mimicking estrogen in their body. The other is hiding in your morning coffee in that trendy plant milk you thought was a healthier choice. If you want to know which two nuts are destroying testosterone, stay with me because the next part of this video may surprise you. Now we move into the part of the story that most men never expect to hear. Two nuts that millions of Americans eat every single day are not helping your hormones at all. In fact, they may be working against you. The first one is peanuts, what I call the hidden estrogen bomb. Here's something most men don't realize. Peanuts are not actually nuts. They're legumes cousins of beans and lentils. And inside peanuts are compounds called phytoestrogens. These mimic the effects of estrogen in the body and can tilt the balance away from testosterone. That balance is already fragile in men over 60. Too much estrogen-like activity means fatigue, poor recovery, stubborn fat around the midsection, and low drive. But the problems don't stop there. Peanuts are extremely high in omega-6 fatty acids. A small amount of omega-6 is necessary, but when you get too much and not enough omega-3 to balance it, you end up with systemic inflammation. Chronic inflammation is like pouring water on the fire of testosterone. It smothers hormone production and accelerates aging. Add to that the risk of aflatoxins, toxic molds, that often contaminate peanuts and peanut butter, and you can see why this snack may not be as safe as you thought. Imagine this a man eats two tablespoons of peanut butter every night believing he's protecting his heart. Over time, he notices more fatigue, weaker muscles, and less drive. He blames age. But in reality, the daily peanut butter habit is quietly lowering his tea. The second nut to avoid is cashews, the omega-6 overload. Cashews are everywhere in modern American diets. You see them in snack packs, vegan recipes, and especially in cashew milk at coffee shops. But here's the hard truth. Cashews have one of the highest omega-6 to omega-3 ratios of any nut about 48 to 1. That means almost no omega-3 to calm the inflammation. Instead, you get an overload of omega-6 that drives inflammatory pathways and disrupts hormone balance. Inflammation is the enemy of testosterone. When the body is inflamed, it prioritizes survival over reproduction. That means less testosterone, weaker libido, and slower recovery. If you're over 60 and already fighting natural hormone decline, a daily cashew milk latte is not doing you any favors. Now I know some men will ask, but aren't these nuts supposed to be healthy? The answer is that context matters. 
For young men with strong hormones, small amounts may not make a big difference. But for men over 60 when testosterone is already on the edge, peanuts and cashews can tip the balance in the wrong direction. And that's why awareness is so important. Are you shocked by these two nuts? If this information surprised you, type shocked in the comments. You'll be amazed how many men share your reaction. So let's talk about what you can do instead. The key is to focus on the five testosterone-friendly nuts we covered earlier and apply them with practical strategies. First, let's go over serving sizes. For Brazil nuts, limit yourself to one or two per day. That's enough selenium to boost testosterone and protect your prostate without risking toxicity. Walnuts aim for about seven halves. Almonds, 20 to 25 pieces, which is roughly a handful. Pistachios, around 40 to 50 kernels and macadamia is about 10 to 12 pieces daily. These amounts give you the benefits without overwhelming you with calories. Second timing matters. Morning is the best time for most of these nuts when your body is ready to use fats and protein for energy and hormone production. Add walnuts to your oatmeal. Toss almonds into Greek yogurt. Snack on pistachios between breakfast and lunch. Macadamias pair beautifully with salads or as a side with fruit. Brazil nuts are powerful, so take them with your first meal and let them do their work quietly throughout the day. Third, choose the right source. In the United States, Costco, Whole Foods, and Trader Joe's all sell raw, unsalted nuts in bulk. Avoid heavily salted roasted or flavored nuts because the added oils and sodium can undo the benefits. Look for organic when possible, especially with Brazil nuts and almonds to minimize pesticide exposure. Fourth portion control. A common mistake is mindless snacking. A bag of almonds in front of the television can easily become 500 calories in one sitting. Instead, pre-pack small containers or snack bags for the week. This way you get the nutrients without overshooting your calorie needs. Remember, excess calories still lead to fat gain, and belly fat is another drain on testosterone. Now let's address the timeline. If you switch from peanuts and cashews to the five testosterone-friendly nuts, you can expect to notice subtle changes within two to three weeks. Many men report more stable energy, less afternoon crash, and better focus. Within six to eight weeks, studies suggest measurable improvements in testosterone levels, circulation, and recovery after exercise. It's not an overnight miracle, but it's a steady natural rebuild of your hormonal foundation. And here's a point most men overlook. These nuts don't just support testosterone. They protect your heart, improve circulation, stabilize blood sugar, and help preserve muscle mass. For a man over 60, these are the exact areas that make the difference between aging quickly and aging strong. Think about it just by swapping a handful of the right nuts for the wrong ones. You're influencing the very chemistry that keeps you feeling vital. Let me summarize what we've covered today. Five nuts that boost testosterone Brazil nuts for selenium and prostate health walnuts for circulation and hormone balance, almonds for vitamin E and magnesium pistachios for arginine and improved blood flow, and macadamias for clean fats with low inflammation. Two nuts to avoid peanuts with their phytoestrogens, omega-6 excess, and risk of toxins, and cashews with their extreme omega-6 ratio and hormone-disrupting effect. This one simple swap, removing peanuts and cashews and focusing on the other five, could be the difference between feeling drained at 60 and feeling strong at 60, even vibrant at 65. If this video helped you, hit the like button and subscribe to Seni Health for more science-based tips designed for men over 60. Knowledge like this is how you protect your vitality and take back control of your health. And here's something important. In our next video, we'll uncover five foods that kill testosterone after 60. These are everyday items most American men keep in their kitchens without realizing they may be draining their hormones day after day. Make sure you're subscribed and have the notification bell on so you won't miss it when it goes live. Stay informed, stay strong, and I'll see you in the next video.